Hi everyone, this is Kyuho again. Today's lecture is training number one. Let's take a look at the drawing. Main importance. Understanding of leveling, rotation, and translation. So the meaning of understanding of leveling, rotation, and translation is setting up the alignment system on the part which is we need to understand what are the datums are on the part. So on the drawing, let's look at the datum A. So the datum A is here, which indicates the top surface of the part. And then datum B is here, which is the front surface of the part. And then datum C, which is the left surface of the part. So with these three datums, we're going to do leveling, rotation, and translation. This is a part of Duggan's training sample. So all of the drawings of our training, number 1 to number 12, we are going to do leveling with the datum A and then rotation with datum B and then translation with datum C so priority of datum order is usually alphabetical order but some other parts drawing could be different than our training drawings so please refer to that fact after setting up the alignment system on that origin we're going to inspect uh, dimension number one and dimension number two and dimension number three and four by measuring two circles so and then after that you can see the datum d there and then we're going to understand how to move the origin and after move the origin to datum d we will be able to measure number 11 and 12 dimension using recalling method so as you can see now there is the drawing on the right top of the screen and then you can see the uh, live capture right next to it as well so let's set up the alignment first so first measure plane with four points And then alignment leveling. And then measure line on the datum B. The two points. Press enter and alignment and rotation. Then after that, the datum C, I'm just going to measure a point. And with that point, alignment, click translation. Alignment system is set up. And we are going to measure the first circle. Click apply because I'm going to measure another circle. Move to the, uh, the other circle. 
measure with a four point again. And then press enter. And let's put nominal values for those two circles. XY 2020, which is the uh, number one dimension. And then move on to the next circle. XY nominal 6060, which is the uh, number three and four dimension. Don't forget to put the diameter's nominal as well. And after that, select circle one, which is the indicated red, and then click alignment and translation. Then the origin moves to the center of the circle one. And then right click the circle two, recall feature. Then it generates circle 3, which is for the uh, dimension number 11 and 12. And let's modify the nominal. Okay, that's it for the training number 1. And I'll be back with you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.